guys welcome back to my channel t new love as you guys see from the picture today topic is about comparison between these those two lovely belts one is from hermes and one is from gucci so i will introduce them so this is the hermes kelly belt in eight hope color you guys can see with the white stitching here with the epsom leather with the epsom leather and with rose gold hardware so this one is gucci marmon belt in black color black color with the gold vintage buckle the iconic and the popular belt from gucci so in this video i will talk about the weight the length the width of the belt material price pro and cons of both belts if you want to watch my lookbook with this hair with this hermes kelly belt i will link it down here below and also more detail about my review about gucci marmon belt i also will link in the description box below so in the first time i bought this designer belt I keep thinking did I need the belt with a couple hundred dollars but when I bought my first designer belt which is this one my Gucci Marmon belt I felt so 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 worth it because I can wear it in almost my whole outfit when I go to work or weekend or in a formal meeting and formal occasion I can wear this belt with me and if you count the cost per wear, it's worth it. With a better quality, better belt, and your satisfaction get paid. So now first, let's talk about their weight. Okay, let's start it with zero. Okay. So it's a 140.5 gram for Gucci Marmon. Kelly belt is almost half from Gucci Marmon. It's only 74.6 gram. Wow. and from the width of this belt this one is in the three centimeters guys and this one it's uh, it's around 18 millimeters so if we talk about their size this Kelly belt is coming with a free size so you don't need to worry about the hole or the hole in this belt because there's no hole here it's only in here this one is for lock okay so you don't need to worry about the whole sizing and it can be adjusted onto your waist see this it's adjustable so it depends on your size and this Gucci Marmon belt it's coming with the 90 centimeters in a size 90 and the white is three centimeters and I already added some holes which is I don't recognize anymore uh, which which one is the original and which one I already added but since I got this Kelly belt I don't need to worry about the size around my waist so let's talk about the material the material of a Kelly belt is in the Epsom leather in the epsom leather and this gucci marmon belt it's coming with the calf skin smooth leather and i've been using it for two years and this one is almost three years so i can tell you the galley belt is not get it's not easy to get scratch except for the buckle so you need to a little bit more careful with the metal buckle here or it will get scratched but you can see from the Gucci belt it's using a gold vintage buckle which is so looks so classic and it's not easy to get scratched or if it gets scratched it won't notice you won't be you won't get notice of it except for the leather but almost three years but almost three years I wear this belt uh, the skirt is still okay the leather is still good 
nothing serious about it and both of them still in a good condition guys see that and now let's talk about their price as from brand new from the store this Kelly belt price is And from the logo, you can see this belt looks more understated than the Gucci Marmon. And the popular belt from Hermes, as you guys know, with the edge leather in here, with the edge leather buckle, which is it's similar with the Gucci Marmon, right? So that's why I decided to get the Kelly belt because it's more under understated. And from the function, the Helmes belt with the H logo with the H buckle is similar function with this Gucci Marmon but that's why I didn't pick it and this Kelly belt looks more feminine compared with the Gucci Marmon and if you wear a dress combined with the Kelly belt it looks so classy and feminine and this Gucci belt looks more confident and casual well actually it depends on your outfit actually so back to your outfit so let's talk about the occasion and the function both of them has a similar function as i mentioned before depends on your outfit at that time you can dress up or you can dress down with both of them but one thing for sure the ca this kelly belt looks more feminine because of the smaller white see this it's almost a half from the Gucci Gucci belt Pro and cons and the cons of Kelly belt after a couple hours if I wearing this belt on my waist I feel I need to adjust the length again in here I need to adjust this length again because it's getting wider and wider so I don't know why it's sometimes annoying me so that's that's why sometimes I need to rearrange again uh, I need to adjust again the length on my waist and also the cons is I think I need to be careful with the buckle so it won't get scratched so I think that's only the cons of this belt and the cons of a Gucci belt is uh, it comes with so many size options at that time I, cho I choose the size 90 and I think it's still wider for me if it comes with the if I pick with the size 85 I think it's better for me and that's why I need to go to the store and ask for more hole on this side so I can add more hole in here actually I want to add one more in here but they not allow me to do that so maybe uh, because of the limited holes that's the cons of this Gucci Mormon belt and also the leather it's easy to get scratched which is it's black right so you you not uh, you don't need to worry too much because of the color is dark so you won't get noticed right away so please be careful with it and now let's talk about their pros the pros of this Kelly belt besides from the price is like an investment piece in my point of view the way it looks so classy and elegant that's why I love this belt and also it can be adjusted to any size you want see this? you can adjust with any size you want you don't need to worry about the hole it's a free size belt and I like something understated and this belt is kind of it and this leather is not easy to get scratched so that's the pro of this belt and let's talk about the pros of this Gucci belt the pro is uh, this belt is so popular guys it's like a statement piece and if you just wear a casual shirt with jeans just push, just wear this belt and you will look fabulous with it awesome right so every time I want to wear something like a statement piece I can wear this Gucci Marmon belt 
but if I want to use the understated belt I just wear this Kelly belt on me it's a perfect combination you've got the under radar belt and you also have a statement piece belt it's a perfect combination of them and if you think to start to buy a new designer belt I can recommend you go with the Gucci Mormon belt and nowadays the Valentine belt is also popular too and it's also reversible guys so the picture is like this I almost get it but I changed my mind if you haven't buy the Gucci Mormon belt you can search about the Val Valentine belt it's quite popular right now and it's so pretty and it's reversible version so it's a great choice for you so you can have uh, two belts for paying one belt that's for a Valentino belt awesome so that's it for my video today I hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful if you have any other questions or comments about this belt please write them in the comment section below and I'll be more happy to answer your comments if you like this video please don't forget to give thumbs up and subscribe to my channel I'll see you in my next video guys. Bye-bye.